City of Phoenix is planning to bring another source of water online within the next two years. The city shut down the Cave Creek Reclamation Plant years ago during the recession. Now they're turning it back on and making it better. 12 News journalist William Pitts was given a tour this morning. This water reclamation plant has been basically abandoned for more than a decade, but now it's being brought back online to treat a lot more water and maybe one day produce drinkable water. From a drip to eventually a deluge of water. The Cave Creek Reclamation Plant won't be silent for long. We live in the desert, water's precious here, and we always have to be looking out for that next water supply. Assistant Water Services Director Nazario Prieto says the plant was shut down back in 2008. The Great Recession stalled growth, and it was too expensive to keep running. We've seen a lot of growth in the North Phoenix area, and so now we have the demand in the area where we can really support a plant like this. The plan now is to expand it, reopen it, and hopefully use it for new technology. By 2027, 2028, the hope is that we can get that permit so that then we can supplement our potable water system. That's the holy grail of water reclamation, taking wastewater from all sources, cleaning it, and turning it into drinking water. Basically in the Southwest, yes, it could solve a lot of those problems. We need to secure the water before growth happens in the city of Phoenix and we keep planning. Uh, Phoenix is always looking out for, you know, another way to continue to create a buffer, right, to help us ensure that we have that 100-year water supply. But a leap like that takes time. The permit process isn't in place yet, but Phoenix hopes it will be. So the build-out for the plant will include everything the city needs once they get the permit. Many other cities are moving in this direction. We all believe as utilities it's the responsible thing to do. In the meantime, the water that comes out of here will be used for irrigation and to replace replenish groundwater. Construction is expected to start in the next month or two. The city hopes to get the plant finished and up and running by 2026. William Pitts, 12 News. All right. Well, thank you.